Anybody home? Trixie! The uh, St. Bernard was missing, so I got elected to come to your rescue. Hot coffee, courtesy oh. of Kelly's. Huh? Oh, I can use it. <laughs> I'll bet you can. Ruby was worried about you. Why? Well, she figured they'd have the heat turn pretty low in here, and it feels like she was right. Oh, was she ever. Oh. Hey, listen, honey. Why don't you come back with me now, huh? You've been here long enough, right? No, I'm not finished going through all these things. Well, can't you do it some other time? Mm-mm. I want to get it over with. Okay. Well, I guess I can understand that. Oh, there you go. Oh, good. Good. It's going to warm me up in no time. I really appreciate you bringing this by. I was going to bring you some hot soup, too, only we had a run on it at the diner. Trixie, there's one more thing that you could do for me. At your service. Will you bring this box back for me? Sure. And I'll haul everything later? Sure. Mm. Oh, it's just what the doctor ordered. <laughs> Feeling better? Mm. Much. Do you like some? Uh, no, no, it's all yours. How about a refill? Oh, yeah, I feel a lot warmer already. Great. I really appreciate you bringing this. Thanks. Oh, honey, listen, it's no problem. How long are you going to stay here? What are you going to do? Are you going to go right back home after you finish? I'll come by Kelly's. Good. I'll tell Ruby. Okay. Trixie, okay. Here, why don't you... Got a cup. Okay. Put the rest of that in there. Oh, great. Take yeah. the thermos. Go stay warm enough in here? Oh, I'm going to do my best. The coffee's going to help. Don't Good. forget the box. Oh, okay. Here we go. All right. Mm, it's <laughs> Got everything? Yep. Good. Oh, Here. gosh, all right, all right. Got out. it. Okay, babe, now take it easy. Yeah. See you later. Huh? Bye. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. What's the matter? Oh, I, I left the torches burning down there. I'll have to go put them out. Don't bother. There's nothing down there that can burn. Yeah, but, uh... You, uh, planning on carting that with you all the way back to town? Why leave an open invitation for someone to visit the crypt? Yeah, you got a point there. I don't want anyone but me or my men down there. Except, of course, if you care to return one day for another look at the glyphs, I'm sure I could arrange her. For you to accompany me. It's very kind of you, senor. Well, we had better be on our way. Don Mendoza, I'll uh, lead the way. It'll be fast. <laughs> Watch yourself here. Right. He's still not there? Not even servants answer the phone at Casa Dunley. Did you also try Commissioner Scorpio? I am not about to make a long-distance call on your behalf. Well, then how else can we prove that we're not thieves? Well, unfortunately, your one local contact is not available. It's not our fault that Donnelly is out of the country. No, but it is your problem. Why can't you just believe us? Because evidence found in your possession suggests you are not telling me the truth. Evidence? You make it sound as though there's already been a crime committed. For all I know, it has. For the last time, we did not steal anything. Then where did you get the ring? It was a gift. Oh, I see. One of Mexico's fine museums generously bestowed upon you a priceless antique. No. Then you stole it. No. This is, this is really getting ridiculous. But I couldn't agree more. We told you that we're innocent, sir. Now, what more do you want from us? Reasonable answers to two questions. Where did you get the ring? And what did you intend to do with the lever and the plans to the crypt? We told you all we can. I'm afraid, senorita, that is not nearly enough. 
So where do we go from here? The police station. What? Perhaps there your memory will be refreshed. Until I receive satisfactory answers to my questions, I am not about to let you go free.